Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Michelle, and today I have a spring break video that I'm totally not salty about. To be fair, if you guys know me or follow me on Instagram, you'll know that like every year I usually do, I'm super lucky enough that I go away to Arizona with my grandparents. So this is like the first year in four years that I'm not going. And my hair is totally getting darker for it. Like my hair has lost a lot of its, I mean, I'm still blonde, but it's lost a lot of its like super light blonde and my skin is very pasty, but that's okay. I have a girls trip planned for later on in the year with the girls that I lived with in England. So I, I do have my fill of spring breaks. So you guys don't need to feel that bad for me. But if you're watching this and you're going on spring break, then I wanted to share with you my like tips and tricks for outfits on what you're gonna wear for that time um, and just live vicariously through you. So if you are going on a cool trip, let me know so that I can like, you know, creep you and pretend I'm there. Is that creepy? <laughs> so yeah, let's uh, let's get into this video. Okay, my first outfit. I'm genuinely so sad I can't wear every day, but this is, I guess I should back up. Um, it's super big flowy maxi pants that are floral and absolutely awesome. Just paired with a like tiny little tube top. There is something really cute about extremely large pants with a very tight top. It like balances out really well and looks really nice. And it is such a great outfit for spring break and for summer. This pair of pants I got at Urban Planet and actually the tube top I did too. So was a really cheap outfit. Yeah, I guess I can move the camera to show you guys my whole outfit. I can kind of see a bit better from here. Yeah, I need to hem them, but whatever. I don't want to take these pants off now that I put them on. I just kind of feel like wearing them for the rest of the day, but it is not that kind of weather here. Wait, can I see how far I can go even that? Oh. oh. Okay, next one is just a simple, but not simple, just dress. Um, I can, again, back up. So it goes, it's not midi length, it's like goes to my calf, which I can't really show you unless I like jump, maybe. And it like falls down in these ruffled layers and it's got this super cute square neckline, but I've got to show you the best part and it's the back, it comes down so low that it shows just enough skin that like, it's like, you know, sultry. But at the same time, it is perfect for warm weather because then you are not gross and sweaty. You are just like fanning yourself in a like really cute dress. And I do love red. Probably one of my favorite colors to wear just cause it's such a statement piece um, and pop on a pair or some red lipstick. Maybe cute heels with this. This is one of those dresses that you can wear on the beach or you can wear it walking through town, depending if you're where you're going. You could wear it at night if you class it up a bit. It's seriously so cute. I got it from this boutique called Red Dress Boutique. I will of course link it if it is still available online. I bought it in the winter, so I have not worn this out yet. So it was really nice to just try this on for the video and get me super excited to be able to wear it. I'm definitely going to pack this for my girls trip that I'm going on. So I wanted to add like a dressier dress to this cause I know that you guys could be going out to a fancy dinner. I wish I was there. Have I said that enough this video? <laughs> um, so I just added this like super plunging cut maxi dress I got from Shopo. Um, was very unhappy when I first got it cause I ordered a very small size and I had to shrink it in the wash like three times to get it down to this size but that's a different point. So yeah, this is the dress. I think it's so pretty. When I was making my Zodiac sign TikToks, I put this as Sagittarius um, and I'm Sagittarius. It's a very like beachy travel dress. So I love it so much. I'm like really happy with the size I got it down to, even though it took me a few times. But yeah, this, it's like a classic, right? When you just have like a, oh, I can't bend over in it though. <laughs> when you just have a sort of like plunging dress that's like super flowy. And I highly recommend one of these for the summer and for the beach. And another thing I don't want to take off after trying it on. <laughs> 
You guys are going to be stunned when I tell you where this romper is from. Um, super cute, right? That was a little spin, a little 360 for you. Yeah, and it's from Shein. Um, I find things with this fabric that was made on Shein as the nicest things. I just ordered myself a skirt that you guys will totally see, but like... It's so flowy and comfy. I think that for spring break, you guys seriously need to bring a romper. Uh, long sleeve rompers are great because they're like in between warm and cold. You can wear tights with them and warm them and like wear them in the winter still a little bit. But yeah, I highly recommend a play suit for any trip just because they're like easy to just throw on. They only take up one spot in your suitcase instead of two because it is only one item. So. And like, they like look super cute, even though it is just one piece of clothes. I mean, I know I said that my pants and tube top were my favorite outfit, but this is my favorite throw on outfit. Actually, looking at the pile of clothes I have waiting for you guys, probably one of my favorite videos outfit wise, I've made it a long time, but that could just be because I'm like really craving summer right now. <laughs> okay, so I know the majority of things I've shown you so far have been dresses. So to spice things up, I have another dress to show you guys. I got this one from Shopo as well. It is a maxi dress, and I think that florals and maxi dresses just kind of go hand in hand. Um, it's a bit more conservative too, because I'm really not showing much skin at all. It's got buttons that you can unbutton down the front here and sort of like longer sleeves. It's good for a night where it's like a little bit chilly and you still want to look you know, fashionable. <laughs> um, I will back up again and show you guys. And it's so long and so beautiful. It is seriously comfortable as hell. And I think that's what's awesome about maxi dresses. It's almost like you're wearing a blanket in a weird way. So yeah, that's why I want to show you guys this one. Pretty much what I'm trying to tell you from the two maxi dresses I've shown you so far in this video is that if you're like packing, you should probably bring a maxi dress on your trip because it is the best way to be like both warm and cool at the same time. And I mean that in the terms of like temperature. <laughs> so yeah, another thing I would highly recommend. I just have one more thing for you guys. I feel really cute right now. Um, this underneath is not a bathing suit. I ended up just putting on one of my body suits that I could pretend was a bathing suit just because I did not feel like wearing a bikini today. So the last outfit is a super cute cover up. It's actually a, not a beach cover up, but like a lingerie cover up. It came with a pajama set that I didn't get. I just got this and use it as my beach cover up. It is in a huge size. Guys, I would totally recommend getting a size like I mean, whatever is bigger than your own size. I think this is a size large or extra large as a beach cover-up just because something huge and flowy is exactly what's your, what you're gonna want walking from the pool to your hotel or your hotel to the beach, wherever you are, where I'm not, where I'm jealous of, yeah. So I just paired it with this huge hat I got at the dollar store. Um, seriously, I know this trend is awesome. It's here to stay for like quite a while. Um, but I just want to tell you guys that like you can do it at a low cost, obviously, if I'm literally getting this from Dollarama. Um, and the, I mean, if you're curious, the bodysuit is from Shein. The cover up is from Primark. I don't know if they will have a similar one this year, but it is super cute. And there's something about wearing it really big and having it just like coming off the shoulder a little bit. Super cute for Instas. <laughs> Not that that's what I'm thinking of when I'm at a beach, but a little bit. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm like really happy about this hat. It makes me so sad because you guys can't see it, but I am looking out the window at a huge pile of snow. Oh, also, if you wanted a, another version of this, if you really enjoyed watching this video, I do have a pack with me for last year or two years ago, two years ago, when I went to Arizona. Um, and I will put it up in the cards or I'll put the link in the description so you guys can totally watch that too. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it. Like this video if you like this video and subscribe if you feel like subscribing. I will see you guys Sunday? Yeah, I'll see you guys Sunday. Sunday or Wednesday because that's when I post new videos, so. <laughs>